technology is around us every day, and most of us take advantage of all its glory. One man, however, has taken this notion to the extreme. Hello, my name is Jay Becker, and I'm addicted to technology. Ever since I was a little boy, I had an iPhone in my hand. It's gotten so bad that I can't live without my phone for at least five minutes. As years progressed, I got more and more reliant on my phone. It has begun to consume my life in serious ways. Jay has never sought expert help regarding his issue, until today, where he will meet with Dr. McKee, an esteemed psychologist from the University of Pennsylvania, specializing in addiction. So, how long have you been addicted to your iPhone? Um, well, ever since I was like two when I got my first iPhone, I just was instantly hooked onto it. Like, I just can't put it down anymore. Have you ever tried going a day without your phone? Um, like one other time when my mom tried taking it away, but that didn't really end well. Oh yeah, well, I'm gonna give you a test for one night when not using your phone. Um, I don't really know about that. I don't think you can really do it. Dr. McKee has instructed Jay to go without his phone for an entire night. He has agreed to let us film his experience. Okay, I have gone five minutes without my phone, and I, th I think I'm doing pretty good. I mean, so far, nothing, no withdrawals or anything, so th that, that, that's a good sign. That's a good sign. It's been three hours without my phone so far, and I'm sweating, and my heartbeat is increasing. I don't know how long I can, I can do this. Like, I'm I'm not sure. What are my friends doing? Like, what what what, what, what like Snapchat? Like, I don't know. What, like, what's going on in the world? I'm not I'm not being updated. Like, I don't know what's going on. I'm freaking out. Oh my god. Unfortunately, Jay wasn't able to stay away from his phone. I'm quite frankly scared of him after seeing what he's done. <laughs> After five years of extreme therapy, Jay has finally given up his addiction. As you can see, Jay has gone this entire interview without his phone. So much progress, all thanks to the work of Dr. McKee.